All right, throwback Thursday on the heels of Donald Trump's historic arraignment this week. It was 22 years ago. Today, Providence Mayor Buddy Cianci was arraigned in the Plunderdome investigation. Our colleague Jim Terracani had this report back on April 6th, 2001. Onlookers across the street. Cianci arrives in his limo, besieged by dozens of local, regional, and national reporters. I'm uh, not guilty of these charges. Cianci top aide Artin Kaloyan, charged with bribery, slips into court with his lawyer. In the packed courtroom, Cianci and Kaloyan sit side by side. The court orders Cianci and Kaloyan to surrender their passports. The pair of alleged felons released on $50,000 unsecured bond. Kaloyan leaves the court saying nothing. <laughs> After his arraignment, Cianci meets the press. I thought the magistrate was extremely fair. I thought he was very fair and I appreciate the consideration. Cianci says he intends to keep on running the city business as usual, but already there's a growing number of calls for his resignation from top politicians like Governor Lincoln Allman and U.S. Senator Lincoln Chafee, who say Cianci's indictments leave a black cloud over the city, a black cloud they say that won't go away until the mayor steps down. In Providence, I'm Jim Terracani, News Channel 10. Cianci was later convicted of only the conspiracy count against him and served time, as we know, in federal prison. After his release, he was a WPRO radio talk host and then also launched an unsuccessful bid to be mayor of Providence once again.